News from Akron. Four bodies have been found in a home on Kimlin Circle in Akron. Our sources tell us the bodies are of two men and two women, all in their 20s. News Channel 5's Bob Jones is there right now. And Bob, what can you tell us? Well, Danita, it has been a very active crime scene throughout the afternoon. As you can see behind me, family members of the victims and neighbors of the victims have been showing up all day ever since word broke about the four bodies found inside the apartment complex. Detectives have been out here since about 2.40 this afternoon. Here is the very, very latest information that we received a short time ago. We were told confirming by the police that two men and two women who all appeared to be in their early 20s were shot execution style in their heads. Police are not releasing their names, but it appears that a relative of one of the victims found the bodies when she showed up at this apartment complex at Kimlin Circle around 2.40 this afternoon. Detectives have been canvassing this Akron Metropolitan Housing Complex, looking for shell casings and talking to neighbors. A short time ago, we talked to a father and a brother of one of the male victims. They are urging the public to come forward with any information. You whoever did it, come out and turn yourself in. I mean, at least uh, let us have a, a, a case that's closed. I mean, don't leave nothing open like this. I mean, if you did it, turn yourself in. Because if you would want somebody to turn yourself in if they had been your mom and your dad. My brother was a good kid. So I just... Do you know what happened here? My brother was a good kid. He ain't deserved to get killed like that. Whoever did it, I just hope you turn yourself in or you get found. And just moments ago, we learned from Lieutenant Rick Edwards from the Akron Police Department that they believe they have tentatively ID'd two of the victims bear. They are not releasing those names right now. Police have not officially called these deaths murders, but they are treating the case as such. The Summit County Medical Examiner remains out here, and we expect much more information by 11 o'clock tonight. On your side in Akron, Bob Jones, News Channel 5.